So I run a company called Foundation Marketing. Foundation Marketing is a B2B content marketing agency that services everything from Fortune 500 brands to up and coming startups on content marketing. So the first thing that interested me in tech was just this idea that you could literally be anywhere and do work with pretty much anyone. Um, the power of technology is something that has given everyone the opportunity to do work on a global scale and to connect with people all over the world. So for me, the initial interest into technology started with that. My first in into technology was actually with fantasy sports. I'm a big fantasy football guy. It's kind of a passion. It's something that I've been interested in for a very long time. And while I was in university, I started a fantasy football blog. That blog started to take off and I started to notice that people from all over the world were reading it. And that's when the light bulbs went off. It went off that, okay, this internet thing might actually last and there's a real opportunity there. So I started to double down my attention and my time on creating content online. And while I was in my parents' basement, I was able to reach people from all over the world. And that's when it kind of clicked that, yes, this internet internet thing might last and I can probably build a career off of it. So the impact that Foundation Marketing has had on the Nova Scotian economy is a combination of a few things. One, we employ people right here in Halifax, Nova Scotia, and also we've employed people all over the province. In addition to that, we're constantly publishing content, whether it's on YouTube, on our blog, on Twitter, on social media, that will help people better understand how to break into technology, but also how to break into the marketing industry. We provide a lot of free content online, and the hope is that Nova Scotians will consume that content and use it to grow their careers, grow their business, uh, and really make an impact on a global scale as well. I definitely think there are a few misconceptions around getting a career into tech, primarily that everything has to be code related. I without question think that there's a lot of value in coding and in the technology side, but it's important that people recognize that you don't necessarily have to be a coder to get into technology. There are a wide variety of different job opportunities that exist in technology that aren't necessarily writing code. Um, and I think that that's a big misconception that people have, whether it's marketing, whether it's PR, whether it's sales, whether it's account management, product management, there are are tons of opportunities that exist in technology, you just have to be willing to go out and chase them. So at Foundation Marketing, one of the most interesting things about our culture is the fact that everybody is remote. What that means is everybody can work wherever they want. All they need is a laptop and they can do their job. And that's the power of the internet today. All you need is uh, Wi-Fi in a way and you can make uh, your work happen. My advice to anybody looking to break into technology would be to first and foremost have a bit of curiosity. You have to be willing to always be learning things new because that's the most important thing about technology. It changes quickly. It's always going to change. It's never going to stop. So it's important to be curious. It's important to embrace that idea of growing and learning new things and not being uh, limited to learning what you learn in a textbook, being willing to go outside of that and learn from things that you're reading online, to reach out to people and ask for advice and recognize that because of the internet, there there's literally nobody that is unreachable and you can reach out to pretty much anyone in the world and potentially get an insight or some type of information that could help you in your career later on.